This is the future. Zephyr is a good warframe, when you pair her Tailwind's gliding mechanic with Turbulence, you create this insane synergy wherein Zephyr can become invulnerable to enemy attacks. With Turbulence, every projectile won't hit Zephyr and while in air, melee enemies can't reach her allowing you total immunity to damage. The only problem though is that damage over time abilities like those from the XMS units can still affect Zephyr but, with the recent shield gating mechanic, things like damage types such as slash and heat dot pose no threat for zephyr anymore just be careful with toxic eximus though as that does bypass shield and also the acolyte that can silence your abilities and the one that debuffs you with a mags bubble however these types of enemies are not that hard to deal with especially that zephyr has aerial dominance honestly there's no need for helminth builds for zephyr and the clip i'm showing you with eclipse is not even that good of a zephyr synergy at all after her rework Zephyr is one of those Warframes that doesn't need any Helminth builds to be good is also, her second ability and ultimate ability pair well together, Airburst can somehow help pull targets in your Tornado, and we all know how busted Tornado is when you shoot a gun through it, while Tornado also pulls target, but it's slower compared to Airburst pull mechanic so I think it would be better to manually pull enemies in the Tornado for faster kill speed. Now, we all know the power of the Tornadoes, as you all know, Zephyr and her allies can attack each tornado to distribute 100% total damage, including critical hits, and status effects from weapons and abilities to all enemies trapped within a tornado. Critical damage dealt to enemies trapped within a tornado is multiplied by 200%. In the past, I have been using a setup wherein I trap enemies into Zephyr's tornado and then shoot the tornadoes with either Fulmin or the Synapse. It can deal massive damage, and I have missed the opportunity to update this build with the Fulmin Prime, but honestly, I think there is one gun right now that works insanely good with Zephyr's tornadoes right now, and that is the Incarnate Torrid. This weapon can be acquired in the Steel Path version of the Duveri Circuit as a tier reward so, you might want to check out the rotation for each Duveri Circuit and if Incarnate Torrid is there, then might as well grab it. Both the normal and Encarnan form of this gun is solid when you use it with Zephyr's Tornado. Now, I was just scratching the surface of this combo in the clip I showed you earlier. Gas is insane with this build. You can go viral, but I suggest you also try gas build for Tornado Zephyr Incarnan Torrid. The gas damage tick in Tornado is really insane in that it can kill enemies really fast. If you somehow can constantly pull target with Airburst or even the Nautilus Cordon mod close to your gas tornadoes, then they will melt instantly in seconds. Only my Zephyr build, I have a mix of high duration and high range simply to get the maximum value A I have for turbulence duration, and to somehow lower the energy consumption of Tailwind, while range is needed to of course pull enemies closer to your tornadoes. However, narrow minded can be replaced with any mods if you think that you are good with primed continuities duration. Overall, this is really an insane Zephyr build right now that you should have tried. I just missed the opportunity to make a video about it earlier when Encarn and Dorid was new. Well, better later than never I guess. Go try out this combo later and I hope you enjoy it. A quick update on my Twitch stream before you leave this video though. Sadly, my cough developed into flu and I really can't stream right now in this condition. Also, I'm sorry for not using real voice again on this video but rest assured that once I'm back in top shape, I will be streaming again and using my real voice in my videos. Thank you so much for watching. Squad Leader signing off.